Hi, Kim Schreier, representative from the 8th District, coming to you from South Curry, where we have been talking about infrastructure and how much uh, a small town depends on this. It turns out uh, that here what we need is help with the wastewater treatment system and piping, because uh, we are coming up against an emergency. And it turns out that the same uh, American Rescue Plan that put kids back in school and shots in arms is also helping with projects like this. Thank you. I'm Dave Morrell, Pierce County Council member. This is one of the benefits of the ARPA funding that the county was able to realize that a lot of our small rural towns just do not have the capacity nor the resources to deal with these type of emergencies. So we put together a plan to allow our small rural towns to get ARPA funds to deal with these type of emergencies, especially infrastructure emergencies. So we're grateful for, for the ARPA funds that we got from uh, the federal government and the mayor has one of the recipients of that. Thank you. Yes, I'm Mayor Carolyn Norris from the town of South Prairie and we are pleased to have been able to receive a grant, a proper grant to help with our imminent uh, outfall situation that we have here in town. These funds are going to be instrumental in making sure that um, our septic sewer plant continues to function while we look for ways to improve the situation and uh, help the town out in a really critical time. the community uh, and coming up on a possible emergency and uh, Mayor VC, would you like to make a couple comments? Well, I appreciate you guys coming up and looking at the system we have and uh, the challenges we're facing with what we got here and it's been a challenge for a long time with a growing community and uh, we need to change and uh, you know until you see what's actually happening up here you don't know the repercussions of what could happen if we don't do something soon so I just appreciate Dave and Kim coming out and seeing what we got going on. So, go right ahead. And I'm council member Dave Morrell and Carbonado is one of my small little rural towns and uh, ARPA funds are being distributed in the way of grants to help them in these emergency situations with treatment plants, water systems, and uh, just to keep the towns going and growing is a very important. That's right, small enough town that it's really hard to afford new infrastructure, uh, but also small, small enough that uh, a gigantic septic system will work for a town this size. So uh, thank you very much. Hi, Kim Schreier from the 8th Congressional District. I'm here in Wilkeson today, standing on the edge of Wilkeson Creek and talking about how important it is to make sure we have a system that works to prevent the wastewater uh, from accidentally backing up and ending up in this pristine creek. And so I'm here with Mayor Sellers, so would you like to say a couple words? Yes, yeah, so same thing, you know, we're just, you know, getting funding and we're working on funding uh, to shore up the telemetry of this system to make sure that uh, Things like that don't disasters don't happen. It's like to the help of Pierce County, we're, we're doing that. Excellent. We'll do our part too. Yeah, and I'm Dave Morrell, Pierce County Council District One, and the county used ARPA dollars to help our small rural towns in an innovative program that we put forward, so that way we could deal with potential catastrophic environmental issues like sewer treatment plants, water systems. So we're just grateful for the ARPA dollars to be able to push it out to our small towns. And uh, so, That's thank great. you. Translation, ARPA, American Rescue Plan Act. The same, the <laughs> same act that got shots in arms and kids in school and kept families afloat also is protecting the town of Wilkeson. Thank yep. you very much, Mayor and Councilmember. Sure.